Hi, I'm Katie. And I'm Anne. And this is this month's Star Wars box. Shwing. It's the Smuggler's Bounty box from Funko. Funko. And how many of these have we gotten so far? Four, but we have videos on two others. We'll link to those um, below. Yeah. We've always liked them, which is why we continue to buy them. We pay for these with our own money, and Katie pays for them with her own money, uh, which is even better. So let's, we haven't even opened this yet. We've saved it to film it. It's been killing us. So let's try it out. Let's crack it in right now. This month's theme is Boba Fett. Boba Fett. Uh, there's always a pin and a patch. So the pin is, ba -ba -ba. Bosk the Bounty Hunter. Bosk the Bounty Hunter. One of the most feared bounty hunters in all the galaxy. And the patch is, I dropped it. I dropped it. <laughs> It's Boba Fett. Yeah. The patches always have a really nice design. I just have no use for them. I'm going to sew them on my jean jacket like it's 1983. <sighs> we have four of these. And what am I going to do with these? I'm going to sew them on my jean jacket like it's 1983. You, you, you can uh, use these as an actual patch for clothing. Just put them in random places. <laughs> like, you got a hole in your blouse? Just sew that sucker right there. Wear it straight to church. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> Prom? Yeah. And then the shirt. Da, 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 da. Is the shirt your favorite thing each month? I, I like the shirt. It's just man cut. Oh, let's see what this one is. It's I wear these to sleep. Or when I'm lazy. They're boxy. They're, They're boxy. Just like a little curve. You can... Lady cut the shirts. Smuggler's bounty box. I would be willing to pay more money. Come on, Funko. Get with the lady stuff. Like... The box is 25 plus shipping and handling. I would pay 30 or something if they had a woman's option. Oh, this is really cool though. This shirt is... Designed for a 12 year old boy. Designed for a 12 year old boy. It's all the bounty hunters. I wish this came in big size lady sizes. Look at that. That's so cool. Would this fit me? No, this wouldn't fit me. Super cute though. The mediums might fit you. Oh, because they're man sizes? Yeah. yeah this, is, this is a small and it looks like a women's like 10. Sure. So it's it's super boxy. Okay. I'm sure I would be an extra small because these still don't fit. But like, They're I don't want to I don't want to take that chance. I, I love the original designs though. They have really great designs and they're unique and special and I think it makes it very fun and worth it. Yeah. But I just would love to see it on a ladies' cut T-shirt. That's all. That is our number one complaint. Take out the fun coat. I see the figurines. Yes. Uh, the fun Co figurines are exclusive to this box. Um, I want this one. I want. It's usually like a pose or, um, I actually found out from the last one, uh, the exclusive main character, um, figure was Obi-Wan, Ben Kenobi. Not Obi-Wan, because he had his hood down. He's a young Ben Kenobi. He had his hood down. So this is this month's. I think the special, um, feature is the pose. Usually there's something more notice noticeable, like the... Uh, Texture on Chewbacca figure. The Chewbacca was flocked. Yeah. So this is figure number 102, Boba Fett, from the pop Star Wars. And he is gorgeous. He's, I want him on my desk. He's in, he's in flight, and there's smoke and such. Yep. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Let's see. There aren't the usual little things, like um, in the Chewbacca box, there was... A pen, and they don't have any of that this week. Oh, the pen was cute. Yeah. Okay. But you do you always get two figurines? Yeah, you always get two figurines. Um, a main character, a um, beloved character. He wasn't a main character, and oh, an no. obscure character that wouldn't normally be made. But this is IG88. <laughs> You're not a real fan if you don't know IG88, Katie. I've seen them all. I just, I think with the, since it has guns, it's probably, um, another bounty hunter. Another bounty hunter. I think it's all bounty hunters this month. Oh, it is. It's all bounty hunters. All the stuff in here is exclusive. Again, box was, it's bi-monthly, and it's $25 plus shipping and handling. Our shipping's at eight. So that brings it to, like, 30, um... 32 and change. Yeah. Is it worth it? Do you still find it worth it, Katie? Um... I'm a little disappointed with this box since it doesn't have the little bits and bobbles and... She likes the tchotchkes. Mm -hmm. I, I love the um, Boba Fett figurine. I hope to wangle that for my own uses. 
Uh, I'm pretty sure you can still buy this box and other past boxes at the website. So we're pretty sure you can still get this box and other previous boxes on the website. Yes. Um, so everything in here again is exclusive. You buy it individually? I don't think so. That would be not a good idea to buy. They, I would rather sell you a $25 box with everything in it than bits and pieces. Yeah, and plus Funko figures are worth like $8 I and a shirt, exclusive. So. A shirt and two exclusive figures are, a, that's a pretty good deal, especially for Star Wars fans. And if you love the Bounty Hunters, I think you'll like this box a lot. Look at our other reviews. Give this one a thumbs up. Uh, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Okay, so that's all for this review of the Star Wars Smugglers Bounty Box. We will see you in... July with for the next Smuggler's Bounty Box. Check out our previous reviews.